Hi everybody, this is Paul Poy, CEO of Airbits, and today I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a new account and wallet with the Airbits mobile application. So here I am at my home screen, and I've got the Airbits icon, I'm going to tap on that and launch the application, which goes directly into our beautiful business directory. So to create a wallet, you're just going to tap on the Wallets tab icon on the bottom right, and we we'll quickly get into the login screen. You've got to create account button at the very bottom, so I'm going to tap on that and we're presented with a sign-up page. And notice that the sign-up page just requires a username, password, and a four-digit PIN. That's it, no email, no phone number, nothing else like that. So it just shows you how private the Arabits wallet is. So I'm gonna create this username here. We're gonna start with happy, let's say 21. And in the password field, I'm gonna choose flappy. And then notice as I type in my password, we're already showing you the requirements for a good password that ensures really good encryption making it harder to crack your account. I'm going to choose Flappy, I'm going to put some numbers in there. One, one, two, two, there you go. And now all my password requirements have been fulfilled. Now I'm going to repeat that password. F-L-A-P-P-Y, one, one, two, two, hit next. Now I've got a four digit pin I've got to do. Let's go one, zero, one, zero, and I hit next. And notice now that Creation of your account is going to take a little bit of time, 20 to 30 seconds, and at the, during this time, Airbits is heavily encrypting your wallet and it is backing it up. Before you have any opportunity to send or receive funds, you're automatically encrypted and you're automatically backed up. So we're going to let this go ahead and finish, and there it goes. So now your wallet is here, it's created, ready to go. You notice that you got one wallet already created for you on the screen. It's called My Wallet. It's got no transactions in it right now. What we're going to do is we're going to create a second wallet and show you how to do that. On the top left of the screen is a little plus button. Just tap on that guy and you get a new drop down. Here you can name your new wallet. You can always change its name at a later point in time, so don't sweat it if you can't think of a name right off the bat. But I'm gonna call this my cash box. And now is when you have the opportunity to choose which fiat currency is gonna get tied to this wallet. Note that every transaction you make in any of your wallets actually has the value of the fiat currency tagged to that transaction at the time of the transaction, which makes it really easy for you to do um, actual financial tracking with that wallet. So I'm gonna choose for this guy, oh, the Euro. And I hit done, and it spins for a while because it's also applying great, incredibly strong encryption for that wallet, and it is backing up the private key of that wallet as well. And there you go, you've got two wallets in your account. You can tap on the right side and actually drag and drop and resort them. Whichever wallet is on the top is the default wallet that you use whenever you click that send button at the bottom and you can actually take your wallets and also archive them by just simply dragging them into the bottom and tapping that little arrow downward will hide whichever wallets are in the archive not showing their balance. And that's it folks, that's how you create a new account and a new wallet with the Airbits Bitcoin mobile application.